uh, we are here with Mr. Lambie today. Uh, what is your name, sir? Uh, Mr. Lambie. That is Mr. Lambie. All right, so we're going to be talking about the structure outside. What have they been building? I don't know. Let's ask them. What have you been building, Lambie? We started last semester. The kids designed, built 3D models, and then started to construct uh, what Mr. Rasmussen calls an arbor, which is something to grow vines on, and a play structure combined into one thing. And I helped with it, did I not, Lambie? You dug some pretty fine holes, Diego. That's right, I'm pretty fine at digging. Anyways, so we're going to be talking about a meeting that went on about keeping it or not keeping it. So what's up, are we going to turn it into a skate ramp or are we going to keep it, Lambie? Uh, you know, the meeting just happened yesterday, so I don't know, you know, I don't have all the details, but there were good things and bad things. There were certain things that definitely have to go, uh, and certain things we definitely have to change, and some things that the guy is trying to work with us on. The dude was really responsive to the work that we did. He thought the structure was awesome, and so he wants to do everything he can to keep it, but there are some things he's got to put in his report, like the telephone poles, and the fact that they have this chemical in them. And so he's got to figure out for us if there's any way that we can encase them. We already primed and painted them, but apparently this stuff still oozes through. So we're trying to see if there's a way we can keep the kids away from it and catch anything that does come out. Mm -hmm. Interesting. And so did you attend the meeting, Lambie? I was not at the meeting. I don't think they wanted me at the meeting uh, because, well, I, won't, I should stop there. But uh, it was just Miss Tolan and someone from the district, two people from the district, who were there. And the Pace guy, who's the guy who inspects playgrounds uh, for our district and I think others. Alrighty. So let me ask you, Miss Lammy, do you prefer longboards or shortboards when you surf or skate? Oh, man. Okay, so when I skateboard, I prefer a longboard because it more resembles snowboarding with a shortboard. I agree. So, Mr. Lambie, what kind of bikes do you have and what, kind, what is your favorite one? Oh, I have a, actually a, uh, what do they call them, like a low rider, like a really long one. Probably the longest one you've ever seen, Diego. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I, I'll try to, uh, you know, get that to the school sometime so you can check it out. And my girls have lots of cool little uh, pink and purple bikes that they like to ride. And I just bought a, a mountain bike that I fixed up for $100 that I ride around on a track I'm building in my yard. That's a pretty good deal. Uh, so, Mr. Lambie, I forgot my question. Uh, we will be back with you in, uh, in a short break. I stop real quick. Here with Diego Vallejo. Uh, what is your name, sir? Diego Vallejo. All right. Uh, cool. So. What was that like, uh, interviewing Mr. Lambie about the play structure? Oh my goodness, that Lambie guy, jeez, uh, I don't know, he was kind of weird, I'm not sure if I fully liked him, uh, uh, yeah, I really he used to believe at me, kind of crazy, um, but yeah, he was... Alright, so okay. that was, uh, that was Diego Vallejo, nice to hear from him. Uh, who are you going to interview next? Uh, I don't know yet, I guess we're, uh, we're thinking about... I don't know. I guess we're just going to ask Lambie. All right. You heard it here first. Back to your daily lives. <laughs>